Yo, what is good everybody? This is your boy Tony Medina coming to you with Just The Why Tony and today I'm here to talk to you guys about 8th place trophies. Look guys, my whole life I've been in sports. Since the young age of 3 to 4 years old, I've been playing baseball. I've been going to the parks and kicking the ball. I've been doing sports activities. At the age of five or six, I was finally old enough to join the baseball team in my community. And in this community and in this league, everybody got a trophy. Whether you were in first place, whether you were in third place, or whether you were in last place. And I'm going to tell you, throughout all the years, I hit every single one of those. There were some years where we were the best team when undefeated. There were some other years where we lost every single game except for one. And there was other years where we were minimal. And we did half and half won, half lost. Look, guys, at the end of the day, no matter what team I was in, no matter the amount of work that the team put in, we all got a trophy. Now, I'm not here to tell you, well, I really am here to tell you. Look, guys, getting rewarded for some work that you didn't do is going to lead to you wanting to get rewarded for work you didn't do in the future. How is that bad? Well, think about this. You're 25 years old. You're going to work. You're doing what you're supposed to do. And you're not getting rewarded. You're just getting paid. You're just doing what you have to, and they're giving you what they have to. Now, if you don't do what you're supposed to, like a lot of people don't do, you're going to get fired. And when you get fired, you're going to question it. And you're going to ask, why did I get fired? And here's the thing, guys. When you were younger, you got rewarded for work you didn't do. And when you were older, you expected that same reward for that work you didn't do. And it's not that way. You see, the real life and childhood are entirely different. And when we live our lives with all the lessons that we learned in childhood, that's when we fail. So I'm here to tell you guys, don't ever accept 8th place trophies. Don't ever let anyone give you or a loved one an 8th place trophy. Because the psychological damage that it does to you, the physical damage that it does to you later on in the future, later on down the road, is a lot worse than accepting that trophy. Than the pain of not accepting that trophy. Sometimes it's better to not accept that trophy because in the long run, you'll benefit a lot more from it. I can tell you right now that if I never ever got rewarded for the amount of work that I didn't do, I'd be in an entirely different place because my work ethic would be entirely different. My mentality would be entirely different. The way that I carry myself would be entirely different. My whole dynamic would be entirely different. Think about that. If you weren't rewarded for that trophy that you got in high school for being in third place and not classifying in CIF and not classifying in whatever it was that you were supposed to classify and you were just left there with all the pain and regret, that would only push you to be better next year. But because you got rewarded for being in third place, you were content with it. At least I got third place. I still have something to show for it. No, guys, always strive for more. Don't let that minimal attitude take over. Take charge, take full control, make that decision, and go about it. Always strive for more. Always be better than what you believe you can be. Because trust me, you can be. And if you don't know how to be, don't be afraid to go and ask. There's a lot of people that are willing to help. With that being said, guys, don't forget to follow me on Instagram, Snapchat, Facebook, Twitter, and the tube. And don't forget to subscribe. Like, really? Don't forget to press a little bell right next to the subscribe button so that you know when I post videos. Hell, at the end of the day, it's only going to be twice a week. It's not that annoying, I think. But yeah, guys. Like the video, don't like the video, share the video, don't share the video. Do whatever you gotta do, do whatever you wanna do. I'm not here to tell you how to live your life, I'm just here to suggest. With that being said, guys, 